Well, <clears throat> it is a beautiful Sunday afternoon in South Kakaleki. And I've been wanting to do this since I got this bad boy. The real 20 inch 62cc. So we got the D reel 62cc 20 inch bar chainsaw. Now, this thing, this thing is a beast. Okay. Now, as I was saying, this thing is a beast, okay? All right. It's going to come uh, motor inside the case, plastic housing. Okay, you're going to have to install uh, the chain bar and the chain. And then you're also going to have to supply your own bar oil and your own gas and oil mix um, there's the ratio right there I am running the same thing that I run in my weed eater which is 40 to 1 I don't know but I didn't see this until today which is my third time running it goes to show how much I pay attention but it has been doing good on a 40 to 1. The same thing my weed eater runs on. 40 to 1 gas oil mix. Two stroke oil. Okay. Um, these. Okay. I did have a problem getting it started. You'll have to pull the spark plug out. Hit the spark plug with carburetor cleaner. And then just shake it off stick it back in yank the cord a couple times it'll fire up that's if you're having an issue getting it started like a lot of other people now um <clears throat> get back to installing the chain and the chain bar okay the bolts right there i already did mine you're gonna want to run some slack but not too much on the chain. A little side note, this thing does get a little heavy. I was expecting to receive a 18 inch bar, but I lucked out and they sent me a 20 inch, which I'm pretty stoked about. <laughs> yeah, you can't, can't go wrong with that. You know, cut two more inches on the chain, it's pretty good. And it, cuts through this stuff like butter I mean I'm pretty big pretty big it does good um, I'll fire it up and show y'all how it runs and sounds. Two cc twenty inch bar chainsaw, which is 
I like it. Right out the box, ready to roll. Ready to roll. Just a minor issue with the spark plug. Let's pull it out. Douse it on. Douse it with some carburetor cleaner. Shake it off. Throw it back in. Pull the cord a few more times. Should fire up. Make sure <laughs> when you do start firing that up. Kill switch is on. Not engaged. And pull the choke out. This is like first starting out of the box or first time starting it in a couple weeks or maybe like a day. But if you're out here running it, taking a 30 minute break or whatever, you don't, you're not going to need the choke. Yank the cord, fires right up as you've seen in the video and it's been sitting, now it's after 45 minutes. Oops. Spend time with the family and whatnot, taking a break from this hard work, and pulled the cord, fired right up. Ugh. Can't say nothing bad about it. Just make sure you got that bar oil. <laughs> you you keep replacing fuel and, and and oil in it, but you forget about that bar oil. You will burn up the clutch that's on the inside. You will burn up the chain. You'll probably heat melt the chain and the bar and the clutch. So, always make sure you got that bar oil. Alright, that's it for this, this chainsaw review. And a little overview. And a little demonstration. Hope you all have a good day. Enjoy.